Hey guys, Jared Wagner here from Focus Group Florida, Keller Williams Realty. Focus Homes, your local custom home builder, and Focus Remodels when you love where you live and you want to make it better. Okay, it's Tuesday. That means it's Real Estate Roundup. We've got a lot of stuff going on, so here's what's happening. So we've got uh, sales are up in the county, but down in Lakeland itself. Inventory is down year over year. Pricing increases. So let's go into what's happening uh, this week. So in the last um, uh, week, we had in Lakeland, we had an inventory shrink. So only 67% of the homes that were taken off the market because of a new pending sale were replaced with a listing. And when we talk about listings later, you'll see those have shrunk as well. Uh, so that's what's going on. And then the county, we're at 93, almost 94% of all new pendings were replaced. So that means again, shrinkage in inventory, um, which is really interesting because you'd think that there would be more with what's going on out there, but that's just not the case. Uh, average home this week was a three bedroom, two bath at 1,796 square feet. Average list price was 187.42 with an average sold price of 184.33. Average list price total was 337.525 and an average sold price was 332.933. Average sold price to list price went up a tad to 98%. It was 97 for a few weeks. And average days on the market is 29. So you see that month mark is about where we're at uh, at the moment. Uh, year over year pricing, amazingly, uh, this this week last year compared, it's up to almost 16% year over year growth. And check this out the last several weeks. So four weeks ago, we were at under 1% growth year over year for that week. Then three weeks ago, 7.53% growth. Last week, 11.51, and this week, 15.94. So we've had a little dip, and we're on a little back up there. Just to tell you what's going on, this is just the Lakeland numbers, but um, it is interesting that that number is actually going up. So equity is increasing. Don't sit on the fence thinking that you're going to get a super cheap house and a super luxury house for less money. That's not what we're seeing. Average days on the market went up, uh, uh, or it's been 29. It, it did go up a little bit, but it's been last four weeks, 30 days, 27, 26, 29. So around that 30-day mark is what we're seeing. Uh, the pending sales the last several weeks is like a roller coaster on that graph. Um, for the county, we did go up substantially this week from 239 to 314 sales. But for Lakeland, we actually stayed relatively flat, 62 last week, 64. Those are the new pendings, the new pendings. So that's where we're at there. On the um, cancellations, it's similar to what we've seen in other weeks, 17 uh, cancels, 2 withdrawn, 9 expired. So not a whole lot going on as a percentage of total listing activity. In Lakeland, we have a 57% shortage in houses. This was our latest data in October, and if it's shrinking, then we might actually see that number go up rather than go down in the coming months. So we'll, we'll see what happens. Thank you so much to all of our clients. We are so close to our annual give back goal. We're at 54,972 giving back to the community. And we're so close. We couldn't do it without you. Uh, those funds come from the professional fees we generate from helping you sell and buy and all of that business. So we really appreciate you. Active listings. So they've actually gone down. So we've gone um, last three weeks, 735, 732, 695. That's for Lakeland. Very interesting. In Polk County, uh, 3625, 3577, 3562. So those are also just a less rapid decline for the county itself, but actually shrinking inventory, which is what you wouldn't expect when the market is shifting, but that's where, that's where we are. And that's probably why you're seeing those prices uh, continue to remain high. The actual price drops um, are going down also. We had uh, 542, 541, 541, pretty soon this week, 517. So in the listings, the, those prices aren't dropping as much as the county. We're still at that uh, that thousand level. Um, this week, we've got um, a few things going on. Um, we've got uh, stuff. At the, if you haven't checked it out, check out the RP Funding Center. That's great. Check out Parker Street Ministries for their uh, special uh, Christmas shop uh, that they do. I'm just looking at my calendar to see what else is coming up. Uh, the Red Tent Initiative has something going on on the 14th. Uh, Aprons has something going on uh, next on the 15th. Heartland for Children's got things going on the 7th. There's quite a lot. So if you want to get involved with the community, then there's a lot going on. Don't forget to click on the links below for all the various programs and things. Thank you so much for everybody that came out to uh, First Friday. We had a great winner for our uh, Christmas giveaway. Uh, 
Uh, we talked to him on the night. It was last name was Osteen. I happen to remember that. It was John Osteen. So congratulations on the mega pack for Christmas. We appreciate you and have yourselves a great week. All right, talk to you soon. Bye bye for now. Bye.